Hi everyone, uh, Bob is temporarily in the house right now. Uh, I decided to like create something different. 20 questions about me. Just uh, you will, you know, get to know me a little bit better. Uh, let's start with these questions. So number number one is what's your full name? My full name is Babur Rustamov. Well, in in Russian, how you would say it is uh, Rustamov Babur goes from first, uh, last name and then first name. <laughs> Bob number ten. Uh, I'm a huge fan of soccer. In the meantime, just <laughs> telling you about other things and uh, look at Rihanna. I'm not sure if you have seen this quote before from my videos, but uh, she says, I'm crazy and I don't pretend to be anything else. And then there's this uh, even uh, Quavo and Travis Scott a poster I have, which was kind of hidden from my videos. Okay, so question number two is, what's my nickname? My nickname is uh, Bob pretty much but the name uh, in, in uh, when I was in school like middle school and elementary school and in, in basically before I came to America it was uh, Bobr see Russians have this word Bobr uh, if which means beaver so and my name conveniently if you just remove you out of uh, my name uh, you will get that word Bobr uh, and yeah, that means beaver, uh, or some people also call me Bo uh, Bob. Uh, anyway, two of my nicknames, pretty much. Okay, so I'm ready to go outside. Uh, I need to go out and work out. Um, I've I've been not working out for a long time, so I need to go back and build my muscles again and take my uh, body to a good shape. So number three. I have this <laughs> list of questions. Number three, where I was born. I was born in Uzbekistan, and but that talk about um, Russia, it, it was uh, because, you know, my school had a Russian system. We were educated in Russian, and, you know, in Uzbekistan, a lot of people know Russian language and even watch Russian TV. So that's why I always refer to uh, Russian language. And, uh, but I was born in Uzbekistan, yes. Number four, what's your favorite artist? My favorite artist is Kanye West. And um, all right, before we go to my car, yes, this is the car pretty much. My beautiful, fantastic <laughs> car I enjoy. And um, hold on, let me, let me show you back, the back of it. There it is. Oh yes. Yeah, it's been five years since I drive this car and I love it still. Still, I have, it's, uh, its name is Honey. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Number five, what's your favorite movie? My favorite movie is, oh, I actually don't know. There's, there are a lot of great movies, um, but I was watching uh, lately uh, Quentin Tarantino movies. Uh, I mean, I watched like uh, most of them before, but I was like, uh, Rewatching some of them, I watched the newest one, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, and you know my my favorite movie among Quentin Tarantino movies is Kill Bill. Even though Django Unchained is probably a better movie, I still enjoy Kill Bill more. Top three is Kill Bill, Django Unchained, and then Pulp Fiction. Number six, when is your birthday? My birthday is on September 26, 1997. How old are you? I am 21 currently. How tall are you? I believe I'm six feet tall. That's what I want to believe. <laughs> but no, actually though, like I, I, I'm six feet tall. Do you have any siblings? I do have siblings. One sister, she's 18 years old right now. And uh, my little brother who is nine years old. Nine year old in the army, PewDiePie. <laughs> Okay, so currently I'm driving in the, don't mind the short change. Right now I'm driving to, uh, work, to work out. Do you have any pets? That's the question. Uh, yes, I do. I have a cat. His name is Jasper. Question number 11. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is, I would say blue and also red. But I came to appreciate over the years a lot of other colors like yellow, like green, I mean, very 
every single color, color is pretty cool. What's your favorite soccer club? It's Barcelona. What's your favorite food? Um, I like, I would say the Uzbek food. Uh, you know, I'm from Uzbekistan, right? So Uzbek cuisine is uh, wonderful. I would say try that one day in your life if you can. <laughs> but really, of course, in America, uh, you know, besides my mom cooking Uzbek food, when I when we go out or when she cooks something else, it's, uh, you know, I love spaghetti, I love uh, mushroom potatoes with some meat or something like that next to it or I like I like everything you know sushi you name it like I like a Chinese food fantastic fantastic do you have any fears snakes <laughs> three things that you love uh, three things that you love I love uh, I love my family of course family is really important for me I love uh, my friends yeah, I love a lot of things. I love music, I love soccer, right? I love uh, traveling. I love having a good set. No, no. <laughs> but the third thing I would actually mention uh, is uh, probably, you know, my girlfriend or my wife if I had one. But right now I'm single, so yeah. Do you have any good habits? Uh, I have more bad habits, <laughs> I think, than good habits. <laughs> Let me think of one. Um, well, right now, even like the bad habit being actually driving while recording. I don't know if you can call it a habit. Uh, I would say it's just who I am. Just I like to be more transparent guy uh, who is pretty much like an open book. Uh, sometimes it, it is not a really good trait. But I feel like at the end of the day, if you want to, you know, make yourself closer to people, you have to open up, right? And I just like the fact that I'm pretty um, transparent with people. I, I just say the truth, just say how it is. Don't mind. I don't play like mind games or anything like that. Just you know, simple guy. You know, simple as that. With a good heart. With good kind of heart. That's that's my habit. The saying truth. All right, I have essentially arrived at 24 Fitness. That's where I'm currently at, working out. So hopefully we'll have a nice workout and then come back soon. All right, we are back. Top accomplishments? Yes. One accomplishment would be is you know me having a girlfriend. I had a girlfriend before. Uh, I consider that an accomplishment. Because I had to fight for her. Another accomplishment of mine would be uh, winning an award of best couple uh, of a graduation night. That was something uh, really awesome. It was a long time ago, but it was an amazing night. We stayed up till 5 a.m. It was a great graduation night uh, party. Uh, so in that contest, there were like 20 couples, and uh, one of them was uh, my friend and the girl I used to like. Uh, a lot so um, they started this uh, contest but I quickly noticed that my friend was not able to really dance he was literally like a tree he was just like standing there oh no like what should I do like <laughs> uh, but everybody else was like actually like <laughs> dancing around and like together as pairs you know like uh, let's say balls I showed to my friend like a substitution sign hey like let's switch and then like uh, without anyone noticing i sort of like crawled in and <laughs> i switched positions with my friend and i was the one dancing ended up dancing with the girl i used to like um not at the moment i was dancing with her i didn't uh, like it her at that point but like earlier years like you know we had a long sort of uh history between each other and uh, I end up like sort of finishing on that note, like uh, winning an award, you know, uh, with um, the girl I used to like uh, what, at one point. That was kind of cool closure. Uh, and a third accomplishment is me, um, you know, transferring to a good college. And the last question, where do I see myself in five years? In five years, I see myself having a... Uh, I'm not sure about the family yet, although I really want to have a family. Uh, I, I just don't know if it's gonna happen in five years. 
we'll see about that but of course family would be lovely uh, but top priority would be you know actually having the financial independence so i can afford family so i can actually move with my family uh to some good place i mean san diego is a great city uh but i'm just saying like actually afford things to live in san diego and to possibly travel that's what i meant by moving like i just like travel the world you know that showing uh my w amazing wife uh, one day uh great places and like should actually have just like fun have fun together uh that's what i want and uh, you know my kids as well in the future but uh in five years my top priority financial independence i want to earn money possibly hopefully you know off of youtube as well you know maybe uh i will be a good youtuber who knows who knows what's gonna happen in five years but um uh, you know i i'm looking forward to having a youtube channel still in, in five years that would be uh really uh, amazing all right that's pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching uh hit the like button if you enjoyed this type of video um and uh, you know hopefully they will get better once i practice to make these videos uh, more you know i'll see you guys in the next ones goodbye